How to replace your Honeywell thermostat battery. Hello everyone. Today we're going to learn how to replace the battery in your Honeywell thermostat. This is an important task to ensure your thermostat functions properly and keeps your home at the right temperature. Don't worry, it's a simple process and we will guide you through it step by step. What do you need? First, let's prepare. You will need a new set of batteries. Refer to your Honeywell thermostats manual to find out the correct type of batteries. Most models use A or AAA batteries. Your Honeywell thermostat, it's already on your wall. How to safely remove the old batteries? Safety is paramount, so make sure your thermostat is off before you begin the battery replacement process. Here's how you can remove the old batteries. 1. Locate the battery compartment. In most Honeywell thermostat models, it's located at the back of the device. 2. Open the battery compartment. Depending on the model of your thermostat, you may need to slide or pull the cover off. 3. Remove the old batteries. Remember the orientation of the batteries before removing them, as you'll need to place the new ones in the same way. How to insert the new batteries? Now that you've safely removed the old batteries, it's time to put the new ones in. Follow these steps. 1. Insert the new batteries. Remember to match the positive and negative ends to the markings inside the battery compartment. 2. Replace the cover. Once you've placed the batteries correctly, replace the battery cover. Make sure it's secure. 3. Turn on the thermostat. After replacing the cover, turn on the thermostat and check if the low battery indicator has turned off. And that's it. You've now successfully replaced the battery in your Honeywell thermostat. It's a simple task, but it's crucial to ensure the continued operation of your device. Regular maintenance of your thermostat, including timely battery replacement, will help ensure optimal function and longevity. We hope this tutorial was helpful, and thank you for watching.